What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to start our playthrough of Minecraft Dungeons. I picked this game up at launch and I played a little bit of it with my brother. Uh, but then I decided to wait for the first DLC to come out to do a full playthrough. Um, and yeah, so that's what this is. I did the, the what do you want to call it, tutorial mission first, if you will. And then we're going to go on to Creeper Woods. Um, I'm always going to play on a difficulty higher than the power level I have. So, so just to give it a little, uh, little extra difficulty. So let's see if we can actually do this. You know, the, the only weapons we have right now is the like starting sword, starting bow. We upgraded the sword once, has smite, so it does some extra damage. Um, and then we have two artifacts. We have the firework arrow and then the fishing rod. So, we don't really have much. No armor, nothing. Real quick tangent. So, like, zombie apocalypse would already be terrifying enough, you know, because there's just thousands upon thousands of mindless zombies that want to nom nom your brains. But a controlled undead army? Infinitely more terrifying. Like Game of Thrones, right? You have, I mean, spoiler alert if you haven't seen Game of Thrones, but you have the, the Night King and how he can control or can, like raise the dead basically necromancy if you had to fight like a hardcore badass necromancer in real life like you get fucked you like the world the world's over he wins and it's like because no matter how many how many people you kill or how many of the undead you kill everybody that dies is just a potential recruit for the fucking necromancer's army so perpetual like perpetual like recruits for him essentially craziness tangent over about fighting undead armies in real life Boom, fireworks bitches so yeah I guess we're just freeing some villagers so they don't go into zombie slave camps or whatever they do with the villagers. Do they just turn them into more zombies? Like, what do they do? I'm invisible. So far, so good. So far, so good. Creepers also suck in Minecraft dungeons. They're garbage in Minecraft. They're arguably worse in Minecraft dungeons. cows. Sometimes I'll drop food. Yeah, and those en uh, enchanters, witches, whatever you, whatever those are called, you have to kill those. Like, if you go into a group and you see one of those, it should be your first objective is to kill those, because they buff units around them. Or enchant them, I guess is the best way to put it. Because it gives them, you know, it might do like double damage, or like damage reflection or all sorts of crazy stuff so it's always good to kill the enchanters first shooting all the creepers oh jeez okay and you can hit tag if you're playing on computer or PC, I don't know what it would be for console, but you can pull the map up and have like the overlay on your screen like this. I'm not going to play with it like that through the playthrough because I feel like it'd be kind of distracting uh, to watch. Uh, you might see me occasionally pull it up just to kind of get my bearings, but I'm not going to just run around with it constantly up. Because that's the cool thing about this game, like there, there's not just one way it's like it's not linear necessarily in the way that it's like as long as you're going this way you're gonna find the end you can definitely take weird turns and find little back rooms and little loot boxes here and there that you wouldn't normally find so it definitely pays to venture around a little bit bread a little bread Thankfully, spiders aren't too busy. Yeah. 
Give me all your monies. New sword. For sure. Salvage. Get that point back. Put it on the smite on this one. I believe we have another point too. Power punch. <laughs> add, a, add some little uh, knockback to our arrows. And my goal with this is to, like, each episode pretty much is going to be one level. Um, depending on how long the level takes. You know, if it's a couple of short levels, then I'll probably just put them all in one uh, episode. But I'm going to play play through all on every like difficulty because as you beat it like you beat it on normal you unlock a harder difficulty so on and so forth so that's going to be the goal see how far we can make it before it just becomes absolutely atrocious to try and do by yourself i don't think it's going to be too hard to, to solo necessarily you're just going to like i'm going to have to pay more attention to my uh, gear because I'm going to want to do, I'm going to want stuff that's going to benefit me the most. Damn. Salvage. Bonus shot. Bonus shot for sure, bonus shot. Dead. 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 Find the exit. God, there's so many of them. Turning into a pin cushion. Wow. Just got absolutely, uh, Not annihilated, but swarmed, I guess that's the word. Come on. Jeez, okay. Push back, though. Ha, you thought. Wait. Potion of swiftness, potion of swiftness. I'm so fast! Come on with it. But you won't. Get it. Yes. Yes. Is there no one else? Is there nobody else? Okay, I guess there's not. Victory! Alright guys, that's uh, episode All one. Thanks to you. That's what, the Creeper, Creeper Woods? Creepy Woods? Creepy Uncle Woods? What was, it, what was it called? Alright everybody, that was episode 1 of Minecraft Dungeons. I hope you enjoyed watching it as much as I did making it. If you made it this far, congratulations, you're one of few. Uh, I hope you come back and enjoy episode 2. Already working on it, so it should come out soon. Till next time, remember, don't get stuck. Bread. I love bread. <laughs>